All right, folks, today we are making these amazing looking smoked maple bacon mashed potatoes. Delicious. It's time to grill. You want to have a spectacular side dish that takes away a little bit the show from your main dish. So here you are. Let's get started with heating up the Kamado Joe. We are using charcoal, some starters. And after letting that burn, close the lid, open the vents and heat up your Kamado Joe to 130 to 140 degrees Celsius, which is approximately 380 degrees Fahrenheit. Get ready for an indirect setup, so half of a deflector and half of grill grates and then add your waxy, not pre-cooked potatoes. This might take a while, you can make this a little bit easier with just pre-cooking these and then smoke them for 15 or 20 minutes. It depends on how many time you have. Smoke, I smoked them for two hours and after two hours the potatoes look like this. Take them off, but keep the temperature on the grill, so just close the lid again. Place them in a bowl and mash them. That's pretty easy. They might have a little skin due to the smoking, which is not really a problem. Just keep going. Then you can add your ingredients for your favorite mashed potatoes. We are adding two egg yolks, butter, cream. And instead of salt, pepper and nutmeg, we are using a barbecue rub today. A Pitmaster X barbecue rub, great stuff. Start mixing with a spoon and later keep on with the meshing tool. It already has interesting barbecue flavors and a nice yellow color. Place in a smaller bowl. And place your mashed potatoes back on the grill. You might have the feeling that you want to recreate this dish at home. Just one advice, check the video description, we have the whole list of ingredients and measurements in there. Place back on the grill and in the meantime make some crispy bacon. I'm just putting my hex clad pan on my gas grill blazing zone, adding bacon stripes and keep on stirring until they are crispy. And as soon as you're done with that, Take off the bacon and place on top of your smoked barbecue mashed potatoes. I really enjoy the combination of flavors here today. We have the smoky part with the mashed potato buttery stuff due to the good amount of butter we placed inside those potatoes, the saltiness and crispiness from your bacon and maple syrup as the final ingredient brings your sweetness. Close the lid, sit there for five more minutes and then take it off and enjoy. Of course, as always, I'm gonna give this a shot right now. Can't wait to hear your thoughts about smoked mashed potatoes with bacon maple topping. I love it. Make sure to leave me a comment and like that video if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate your help with the 0815 Barbecue International channel. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'm out. See you.